good morning from New York. I'm in New York. I am so excited to be here. This is the first time I've spoken words today. Um, but yeah, I, I booked myself a trip to New York just to... Why am I here? <laughs> Basically, um, I just wanted to come to New York. <laughs> I don't know, do I need a good reason? I haven't been here for so long. It's been probably since before the pandemic, which is wild. And I just feel like my life is in such a different space to what it was the last time I was here. And if you followed me for a while, you'll know that I've spent a lot of time in New York. I just wanted to have a solo trip. And I think solo trips are so important. They really take you out of your comfort zone. And I do have a few meetings lined up and I wanna catch up with some friends that I haven't seen in a long time. And I'm just gonna kinda see where the wind takes me. This is just a me trip. Oh, and this weekend, my mom is also coming. Um, and we're gonna go wedding dress shopping, which is so exciting. And yes, we're going to Kleinfelds. So stay tuned for that. Yeah, I'm staying at the Bowery, which is stunning. I've always wanted to stay here. I treated myself to a couple of nights here. I'm gonna switch hotels in a few days. Um, the room is kind of messy, but I'll give you a tour. So here's the front door, and there's this cute little closet here. Lovely, but I will say they do not have kettles in the rooms. Like I went to make, make myself a cup of tea this morning because I'm British now and um, there's no kettle and there's no tea. So <laughs> that was a moment for me this morning. Um, but anyways, the bathroom definitely makes up for it. I said it was messy, which it is, but Gorgeous bathroom, and I got ready this morning, had a gorgeous shower, the view is amazing. And then we'll go into the little room here. So this is the bed. And the view is just honestly insane. It was so beautiful as the sun was rising this morning. There's a little table there, and then there is a big full length mirror. So yes, there's a huge mirror on that side, and then there's like a table here, and the view is just incredible. Um, but it's about 9.30. I've been awake since five. Jet lag life. But I'm gonna head out now to Russ and Daughters because I wanna get a bagel. And I'm gonna get a bagel and come back here because I am hosting an Instagram live at 12. So I've got a couple hours and I just wanted to kind of like power through my emails um, before that. But first, let's go get a bagel. I'm the worst vlogger. I need to get in the zone. I got out, I got my bagel, I'll put a picture here. I ate it, it was so good. And then I've just been working and then I did my Instagram live, which was great. And now I'm just gonna touch up my makeup a little bit and I am heading to a meeting, which is on the seafront. And I don't know if I've, I've probably been there, but I don't remember being there. Where's my makeup? So I'm excited, I get to like walk 40 minutes through like, I think I walked through Chinatown. Um, so I'm excited to go explore. So I walked all the way here, went through Little Italy and Chinatown, which was cool. It is such a beautiful day. It's like super sunny. I'm so thirsty. I stopped, got a bottle of water. I also ran into a viewer. Um, her name's Courtney and she said she wants to come to the Mirror Water meetup I'm doing on Sunday but it sold out, which it did, it sold out super quickly, but I said she could have a ticket. And she was like, what are you doing in Fidei? I thought she said, what are you doing on Friday? <laughs> but I think Fidei is obviously the financial district. <laughs> um, but we had a lovely chat. Sometimes you guys know me better than I think you do. Cause like I feel like she just like knew my entire life story and like understood the things I was saying. So that's quite nice. I hope to see her on Sunday. Um, and now I'm just basking in the sun before my meeting. Okay, well it's actually been a few days since the last time I saw you. And that's because I, I don't wanna say I've been having a mental breakdown, but I've been just like experiencing 
like burnout and I basically spent the last few days just like trying to become one with myself so that's what I've been doing but I have to say I've woken up today I feel so much better I think sometimes when you take time and space to just be alone that's when things can kind of like pile up on you but like I said I'm feeling a lot better now although I did an exfoliating mask last night and my face is kind of puffy and irritated but anyways who cares about that because my mom is coming today and I'm so excited to see her and she's currently flying and I have a breakfast meeting now and I'm gonna head over to the Hoxton in Williamsburg which is where she's gonna meet me and we're gonna spend a couple days together which is so fun I'm so excited having a gorgeous breakfast in Williamsburg with my mom and we got some ricotta pancakes and the Moroccan scramble and we're splitting it bliss so my mom's just stopped on the street yeah. whipped out her phone because she wants this I want this so bad basically what you do is it folds up and you when you go into a grocery store and start instead of getting one of those great big huge carts <laughs> this thing you just pull out of the trunk yeah it pulls up and you put your groceries in this little thing and it's configurable like you right put different things there. then when you go in the house with your groceries yeah you just bring this basket in so you don't need any bags right I'm getting it where do you get it? I don't know. That's why I <laughs> screenshotted it. So I just came into the Great Eros, which is a gorgeous store. I used to come in here all the time when I would spend time in New York. And they have the most gorgeous collection of everything, but it's the clothes for me. So I just tried on like pretty much the entire store. I'm gonna get this sweater, these knitted trousers, um, and they do like stunning lingerie. Ugh, oh, heaven. I didn't try these on, but maybe I'll come back tomorrow and try some more on. This is literally the outfit I bought. So the wool trousers, the little tank, and the sweater. Okay, mom and I have just checked into our room. We are staying at the Hoxton in Williamsburg, and we've got such a nice view. It's so cool. We've got Kendall Jenner down there on an ad so nice and we've got two separate beds because my mom does not like to be anywhere near me <laughs> and then let me show you the bathroom you be some bad press. no I'm not but am I wrong I like to be near you I just don't like to be on top of somebody <laughs> exactly um, and this is a little bathroom so cute and now we are off to get a donut at donut plants and my mom needs some Glossier boy brow. Are you in the room? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, my eyebrows have been a journey and not a good one. I've, I've taken the wrong <laughs> path. Uh, you know, when you should have went right, I've went left. No. Now I've got to throw it in reverse <laughs> and go back. What do you, what do you go say? Go back on yourself. I have to go back on myself <laughs> and get some brow tint. What we need to do is, Kelly has had microblading. We need to get you some tinted Glossier Boy Brow and that's where we're heading. Really crazy. Guys, I just walked out of the hotel and Hallie's here. Hey. She's watched me for like a, a decade. Said, at a least. decade. <laughs> at least a decade. She knows everything about me. I really do. <laughs> it's what true. are you up to today? It's gorgeous. Well, I'm off work. I leave for Ireland tonight, actually. Oh my god! So I'm going to pick up my shoes from the cobbler. None of okay. that, like, leads to the other. No, but you but need to go to the cobbler. That's just what you do before you go to Ireland. I don't want to leave them and then have them Fine. throw off, you know, Fine. so. What are you yeah. doing in Ireland? I'm going there for work. Okay, fun! Yeah. And my friend's joining me, so it should be a good That's time. That's so nice. Well, it's going to be not as hot as it is here. Probably. No, it's Pretty not. Rated. And my carry-on won't zip with all my things, but okay been there we're figuring been it there. out figuring it out we made it into glossier i am so excited to try the milky jelly cleansing bar so i'm gonna buy this and my mom's over here she's getting her brow stuff and i also want to get some brown mascara but this store is so cute it's in williamsburg and I love it. So we headed to Donut Plant, my favorite place in the world because this carrot cake donut right here. Oh my God. And they have so many good ones. 
and me and mom got a cup of tea and you got the pumpkin one yeah. and obviously I got the carrot cake and I am so excited to have a proper cup of tea in a mug and I'm having one with new brows yeah the brows are popping off guys what do we think of the boy brow edition so good Okay, we went out and got some Joe's pizza. We're just having it in the room. Yes. Watching the new episode of Love is Blind. Can I get a ho, yeah? <laughs> ho, ho. Yeah. <laughs> I just woke up and I'm so excited because today we're going to Kleinfeld's. But even more excitingly, unlike the Bowery Hotel, there is a kettle in the Hoxton. Thank you. This is how you know you're at a British hotel, hotel chain. Because I, I don't know how I survived those past few days. I really don't. Now let's fill this up. I'm gonna have a cup of tea and my mom is gonna try instant because as she's pointed out, instant is not the instant of the past. My mom's going like this, like, do not put the camera over to me. We got a delicious breakfast at Sunday in Brooklyn. And I can't wait. Cheddar scramble and mimosas with K-Dog. Mother, where are we? We are at Kleinfeld's. Yes, the Kleinfeld's. And we are going wedding dress shopping. Yahoo! <laughs> And we're super excited. It's pouring rain, so it's a good day to come in. It is. So let's go. Okay, mom, we're inside Kleinville. I know, I'm so excited. <laughs> this is a huge moment for us. Well, years and years of watching Say Yes to the Dress. Like literal, literal years. The only disappointment is I don't think Randy Finola is going to be here. No, my mom loves loves Randy Finoli. And I like his, his dress one too. Yeah. So basically we're waiting in the waiting room and then I guess we're gonna go in. Did you ever think I was ever gonna get married? Of course. I was not sure for quite for quite a while there. <laughs> just hold it. My mom is already crying. It's just so pretty. Uh, let me stand back. Do you think this is me? It's gorgeous. I just think it's so pretty. This is definitely the largest of the dresses that, we, yeah. that we've pulled. Mostly everything else is going to be much more fitting. Yeah. Um, and I think it's very pretty, but I think it's swallowing you a Me little too. bit. Me too. I think it's, it's just big. a little bit. I, I love it. You do? I do. I just absolutely love it. Oh my God, every mom wants to see their daughter. Did you know that? No, I'm not the ball gown type but I just I think it's so beautiful. It's a beautiful dress. This is by Anne Barsh. Okay. After all that excitement, we need to just slow this party down and get some donuts from Doe. Oh yeah. Seth, okay, I was browsing and I was taking videos and I thought Seth was gonna come yell at me and say like, do not take photos in here, but he's like, I've watched you forever. Ever. That's so forever. funny. Yes. Well, you'll never guess. I, well, I'm not gonna tell you that on camera, actually. Okay, okay. <laughs> Guys, Seth works for Caudalie, which we love Caudalie, obviously, and he's very kindly gifting me whatever I want, which is amazing. So we're gonna try these two new products, which I've never tried the Premier Crew range, so I'm very excited. And we all love this, because isn't this Victoria Beckham's favorite? I mean, it's everyone's favorite. If you yeah. have a model or yeah. you want model skin, it's yeah. the Beauty Elixir. Okay, we, we love the Beauty Elixir, and I haven't used this for a long time, so I'm excited about it. Okay, guys, so, this has been a crazy day. <laughs> like, I'm gonna be real. This has been a crazy day. So, the Kleinfeld scoop was, we had the best time. We had literally the best time ever. Um, and so I tried on the first dress, which you saw, and then I tried on the second dress, which I, I filmed it, but I don't wanna show you because I loved it so much, and, I feel like it's my dress, <laughs> so I don't want to show it because then it's out there. So I have to keep that one a secret. Okay, if you are a Say Yes to the Dress fan, you will know Panina Tournay. 
Panina was there and she came out and we spoke and you had a moment. We had a moment and my mom had a moment. My mom was like frantically cleaning. She was so stressed, which was hilarious. Like I was looking at myself in the mirror and I would like catch a glimpse of my mom behind me like organizing the shopping bags, dusting the bench that we were sitting on. Like she was on overload mode and she cried so hard. The first dress that you saw, well the only dress that you saw, I mean it was super pretty but I just think it drowned me and it just wasn't really my style but my mom literally loved it. She was crying and once I reveal my dress I'll post this footage because it is so funny. Um, but yeah, so very good day all in all. Would you say this has been a successful day, mom? One of the best days I've ever had. One of the best days she's ever had. And then after that, as you saw, we got our donut. And then after that, we went to Outdoor Voices. Mom got some new sweatpants, which she's putting in her suitcase right now. And then we popped into Sephora, as you saw. This has just been the best day ever. Um, but the day's not over, because we're going to freaking Shake Shack. Mom's never had Shake Shack, and I don't have Shake Shack often. Um, and I'm excited to go have some Shake Shack, which is delicious, so let's go to Shake Shack. But what a day, what a day. Oh my God. <laughs> yes, Shack Attack. Mom is leaving. See ya. Are you glad you came to New York? Oh, I'm so happy. I had such a good time. And that's it. Just 48 hours together. Yeah. And so. a short flight home, which is yeah. The best thing it's like only an hour and a half, two hour flight home. So I'm gonna walk my mom downstairs, grab a little bite to eat, and then um, carpet the DM. My mom just left. Also. FML. <laughs> yeah, my mom just left. I'm so sad. It's so emotional when, you know, whatever. Let's not get into it. But we had a really good time together and I'm so glad she came because it kind of just gave me a little pep in my step because I was feeling a little blue before that. So I am heading to the Mirror Water community event. The very first time we're bringing together the Mirror Water gang in a city that's not London. So very first one in America and I'm so excited to do it in New York. So we're just gonna go for a little walk around Prospect Park. I'm just tying my shoes here. Um, nice and casual you know but it is quite chilly outside so i actually bought this fleece yesterday in outdoor voices and i also got these ribbed leggings which are amazing i have this damson matter vest thingy and i'm gonna put this on it's like i'm looking out the window it's so windy some people are in shorts, some people are in parkas. I think no one really knows what they're doing with this weather, TBH. So I'm going with this and I think I'm gonna maybe do up a button and then this gets tied in a bow. Um, okay, I also need to quickly tell you about this phone charm thing that you might have been seeing in my stories and stuff. This is by Rosie Fortescue. Um, I have, I don't know if I've ever actually met Rosie, but I've been like a long time fan because I'm a Made in Chelsea fanatic. Don't at me, okay? I love the show and I still watch every episode, but um, Rosie has an amazing range of like jewelry and accessories and Putting this on my phone has become my entire personality. Like when I'm on the phone, I'm like playing with my pearls and I just love it. So I'll link this down below. Um, I actually got this because Amelia has it and I was at Amelia's for dinner and I was like, your phone thing is amazing. I just make, it's making me feel so like, like it makes me feel like this. So you guys should check them out. 
Okay, let's go. I hope people actually show up because it will literally kill me if nobody comes. We are kicking off the community event and I was 20 minutes late, which was horrible, but everyone's forgiven me and we're all just going for a gorgeous walk and getting to know each other. What a beautiful day in Brooklyn. So the walk is over. I feel like we walked like 18 billion steps. Probably. Somebody check their Apple Watch. Um, and I brought some lanyards for everyone. So if anyone wants one, I'm just holding them awkwardly here. I've only got one hand. Yes, people want them. This is like Halloween. Chris, AKA Astro Boy. He's here and he's got his stuff for the taking. Now, if you haven't heard of Astro Boy, you're missing out. Who are you? You know, I'm, I'm not, I can't curse. No. <laughs> I'm that B, you know, I'm. You're that B. I am she, I am, you know. Yeah, <laughs> what's your Insta? Um, Astro Boy, boy with an I, vintage. Yes, yeah. and you can check out a very unique curation of so many different types of things Give and yourself a sexy little night Ooh. out at the yes. rave top you know get yep. a deconstructed baseball hat yeah you can wear two at a time if you want to you know the world is yours for the taking yeah um what else it's true want? sometimes i feel like the world isn't mine for the taking it is it's, the world is what you tell yourself that you deserve okay you know what i mean so i needed to hear that today <laughs> i'm running super late and yes i'm an outfit repeater okay i'm an outfit repeater don't judge me i'm heading there's my wallet i'm heading to manhattan now i have a meeting um and then i'm going to the class yes the class if you haven't heard of it it is a workout class and i'm so excited about it apparently you like cry scream wail and process and that's exactly what i need to be doing okay let's go i got home from the class and it was amazing it was so good i highly 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 recommend it it was like if you've never heard of it it was like chanting jumping dancing um like workout moves it was amazing I really loved it um but I just got back I had a meeting and then I had a shower and I'm getting ready to go out for dinner with my friend Nick who um I have known for so long like so long but we've never actually met in person and that's what happens when you have internet friends <laughs> I'm all about that shit yo I love, hey, I love being in front of um, you love the camera. I love, I love the camera. Okay, listen, everyone. We're having dinner, and I'm going to tell you who is we in a minute, but we're having buffalo chicken, and I'm two glasses deep into wine, but that is because I'm meeting in the flesh for the very, very, very first time. The Nick Says Go. What is going on? We got a buffalo chicken right here. We got some onion rings right here. Finger licking good. <laughs> yeah. Nick, we've known each other basically online for like decades. Oh, I was gonna say seven years, but I don't even know oh, that's accurate. Oh, right? And we're meeting for the first time. In New York, eating good, kicking it. And it's even better in real life. 100. percent Emotional. Thug tear. Good morning. From me, I definitely had a little too much to drink last night. Well, I had like two glasses of wine, but that is too much for me because I just get all crazy. Um, but it was great to see Nick and um, yeah, it was just like a nice way to round out the New York trip, which has been so fun. Um, I feel like when I started the vlog, I was like anxious and low and processing and now I feel so good and I've just had the best time here, which just goes to show that sometimes if you push through things, you can actually end up having amazing experiences. Um, but I'm excited to go home. I go home tomorrow night, so I'm going to end the vlog now, and hopefully you enjoyed watching this. I know it was a long video, so if you made it this far, leave a comment and say, made it this far. I'm curious, and um, 
yeah, I'll see you when I'm back in London. Bye.